YouTube, what's happening with y'all, man? This your boy Ro from Bear Prince, back at you with another video. Hey, I know I ain't hollered at y'all in a little bit, you know what I'm saying, but trust me, trust me, trust me, man. I got a whole lot coming for y'all. Hey, look, man, y'all probably been hearing about this DTF stuff, you know what I'm saying, that's going on, man, so, uh, yeah, I hopped into it, you know what I'm saying? I got me one of them printers, I converted that thing all up, you know what I'm saying, and I got to work, y'all, you know what I'm saying, so, man, man, look. Hey, today, I just want to show y'all how I clean my printer out, you know what I'm saying, with cleaning solution, um, and that's what we're going to do, man. Today, we're rocking with some DTF prints, man. Hey, you know what? Let me show y'all a few things real quick. You know, with DTF, man, there's not really much limits, you know what I'm saying? You can print full-color images various different sizes you can gang up images hey right, man they 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 look very good okay i'm dropping them because i got too many too too many images hold on because i'm hustling man you know what i'm saying and dropping stuff but hey look y'all today we're gonna clean out the printer so i can keep getting these images popping like this you guys you feel me so um that was a long kind of intro but still I'm going to let my intro pop in, and I'm going to holler back at you. All right, YouTube, so we back, you know what I'm saying? So, like I said, man, today is maintenance day. We're going to go ahead and do this. You know, I figured, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, we, we, with the DTF prints, man, if you've been hearing anything about DTF prints and you've been hearing that it's a lot of maintenance, might be scaring some of y'all, whatever, you know, it, it's it's really not that bad. And, you know, it's just like anything else, man. If you take care of it, it'll take care of you. You know what I'm saying? So just remember that, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's really real. If you take care of it, you know what I'm saying? It'll take care of you. So I got my uh, empty cartridges. This is for my cleaning solution right here. Uh, let me 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 turn this around on for y'all real quick. This is the ink right here, the sys system over there. This is the fourteen hundred right here. So today we are going to be doing it like a deep clean you know you always got your, your print head clean or whatever um but this is more going to be like a deep clean i'm gonna fill these up with cleaning solution i'm going to put them in the printer and then i'll be running some print um some print head uh cleanings um because as you know you know if you keep your regular cartridges in there while you're doing this i mean it's just only going to use up your ink you know i mean it is what it is it's cool you can you know figure it out whatever um the case may be you got to do but it's always good to do this um Pretty often, I would say, pretty often. Like I said, um, uh, I probably went through a hundred pack of film in the last couple weeks here. You know, some people are going through that even faster. Um, I think I, I'm either figuring every couple of weeks I'm going to do this type of cleaning, uh, maybe even once a week, because it depends on how much I'm in the printing. Um, I know for sure that every time I'm done with a hundred pack of film, because I buy my film by the packs of the hundred, um, that I'm for sure going to be doing cleaning. Um, I got a bunch of syringes, all that. So I got, I got my C's on here so i know the dudes for my cleaning solution i don't, I don't mix them in with the inks or none of that you know what i'm saying so I mean, let me get y'all hooked up with a better better to get it in y'all um if you if you've done sublimation then it's, it's it's pretty similar to kind of um filling up the ink cartridges and whatnot i would say uh, always make sure you got paper towels and all that stuff around man of course, things can get very messy, and uh, we don't need that. Take these little deals out right here. Like I said, just like sublimation, man. If some of you guys have done the sublimation, it's going to be the same thing. Put your needle on your syringe. I got my cleaning solution right here. So, man, I just got to tilt it. Get it down at a good angle, y'all. 
Just like you will with your inks. Go ahead and fill them up. Clean the solution. Put that back on there. Now this is ready to go in the printer. Let's see what the rest of the do, though. Times it does its own little like clean head, uh, front head cleaning or what, whatnot. Uh, let me get my program restarted here, and then we're gonna run some print head cleans. Uh, once again, I'm with the uh, Epson 1400. A lot of people have been asking me, I've been putting up a lot of my prints and stuff like that. People are asking me um, about my colors and things like that, man. And that's first and foremost you know it's going to be the maintenance guys you know what i'm saying it's going to be really getting that maintenance down and putting everything together you know what i'm saying and uh taking care of your your printer man like i said earlier man take care of it and it will take care of you man most definitely you know and uh i've been printing on it for a few weeks now um my waste tank has already got full um and like i said i bought my printer used you know so that may have been a thing with it too i don't know I'm still not sure how many prints i'm going to get before it gets full again or anything like that um, but it's been rocking and rolling for me guys, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of people been asking, like, is a DTF worth it? Oh, I got a 1400. Should I convert it? This, that, and the third. And I'm like, yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, I'm, I'm going with it, you know? These are the cartridges right here. I have a cartridge and assist system. Assist system right here with the bigger ink in it. So yeah, um, all right guys, so had a little technical difficulties. Program was acting funny, the laptop was acting funny, had to restart everything. Needless to say, I did do, um, I got the cartridges in there as I said, you know what I'm saying? I did about, probably about five or six print head cleanings. Um, boom, I popped my regular cartridges back in. Then I did a couple more print head cleaning so I can get that ink circulating back through there because I had cleaning solution in the last cartridges that I took out of there. Got everything hooked back up. Um, so now we, we're back printing, y'all, you know what I'm saying? So we, we, we on it, you know. White ink coming out. It's coming out on this side, as you see. So, man, y'all, anyways, you know, uh, sorry the video is all over the place, man, but um, we got everything under control. We back to printing. We doing maintenance, man. Hey, all y'all DTFers out there, man, let me know something. You know what I'm saying? I mean, how how often are you doing this type of maintenance? I mean, um, <clears throat> every every day that I go ahead and print, you know what I'm saying? Um, as suggested by my boy Jason over at South Bay Creations, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to him, man. Hey, and shout out to the squad, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I, don't, I might not have gave a shout out to the squad last video or whatever, man. Hey, y'all need to stop what y'all doing right now. Y'all need to go on Facebook and y'all need to find us. Pound Squad, bro. I promise y'all, man. It's the dopest group out there. You know what I'm saying? We're giving up nothing but game. And everybody in there is doing a little something to everything. Like me doing DTF, Jason doing DTF. There's plenty of DTF in there. There's plenty of supplementation in there. There's plenty of vinyl in there. You hit the uh, uh, the homie uh, Mike T's, the, the, the layering master, bro. I swear. You know what I'm saying? So, um, look, guys. You know what I'm saying? And shout out to the homie Seek, too, man. They really got that group all the way live over there, man. So, Pound Squad, man. Y'all already know description gonna be in my bio you know what i'm saying so y'all can go ahead and check us out man um hey this has been another video with bear prince man i'm gonna go ahead and finish this job because i got a few prints to get going man i just want to do a quick video on some maintenance man and uh you know i'll probably be back with another video in a little bit you know doing um pressing up some shirts or some hats or something like that you know what i'm saying or just showing y'all a little bit more printing man maybe we're just gonna sit here and i'm gonna show y'all how long this 1400 takes for me to print you know um as always man if y'all got any advice you know what i'm saying um y'all got some products y'all want me to use you know what i'm saying uh shout out to my boy big boy inks man you know what i'm saying we're gonna start circulating that ink real soon man after this ink i got in there is already gone man so you know what i'm saying so hey man we getting connected out here, man. We staying on it, man. You know what I'm saying? We moving forward, y'all. We trying to stay on the next thing, you know, which is DTF, man. You know what I'm saying? DTF is the next move, y'all. So I got this Prince coming out, man. You know what I'm saying? Well, this is going. It ain't, it ain't coming out for sure because it just started, you know. 
it take a little while, man. I, I timed it. I think I, I don't know. Y'all let me know. Like I said, man, I got my, I think my 1400, you know, I'm printing out 13 by 19 sheets. If I'm printing out the whole joint, you know what I'm saying? Um, it, I'm, it's taking about a good 12 minutes, you know what I'm saying? 10 to 12 minutes, something like that. You know, I guess depending on the design and detail and whatnot, you know, so. Hey, man, this has been your, Ro, your boy Ro from Bear Prince, man, saying, hey, next time you need something printed, man, let me put my print on it, y'all. All right, man, I'm out this piece. Bless up.